So y'all, I'm so excited today. We're getting ready to go to church. We've got our annual holiday dinner, and it's going to be a good time of faith, food, and family. Sharing God's love in the digital world and encouraging others to live by faith. This is Joshua Verwers. Hey y'all, Joshua Verwers. Thanks so much for joining me today. Now, if you're new to the channel each and every week, I'm trying to bring you some content that will bring information and inspiration to help you live by faith. So if that sounds good, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. That way YouTube will notify you every time we upload a new video. Now today was a fun day at church. I wound up getting to preach this message about how God is not only with us, but God is also within us. And I think it really had an impact. I know it did in my own life as I was studying it, and it really felt like it was impacting people as well. What would it have been like to have the Son of God growing inside you? What would it have been like to deliver the Son of God into the world? The answer to that question is a lot closer to you than you realize. Because Jesus is in you. And if we're obeying His Word, there's growth inside. And eventually we're grown so much we have no choice but to deliver him into the world. Then after church, we had our annual holiday dinner. So we kind of take Thanksgiving and Christmas and we meet in between to really just kind of celebrate the entire season. So we celebrate not only giving thanks for Thanksgiving, but also the gift that was really given to us of our savior, Jesus Christ. So I was hoping to have a little more time to record and do some more editing and kind of give you guys maybe a better story, but sometimes life just happens. And we wound up getting a message shortly after getting home that one of the members of the church was going to have to have her appendix removed and they were having surgery tonight. So we wound up hopping in the car and driving over to the hospital to really just be with them and to provide any comfort and support we can. But it also reminded me of today's message that God is not only with us, but he's within us. And one of the things that's happening is Jesus sending the Holy Spirit to really comfort us in the same way that Jesus was there with the disciples then to comfort them. And so I'd just like to leave you with this one piece of encouragement, and that's to get to know the Holy Spirit as your comforter. Now until tomorrow, I want you all just to stay blessed and enjoy God's best.